What is up guys, welcome to another video. Uh, I got some packages in the mail that I'm gonna unbox and then we'll go ahead and install some parts today. To see these boxes just sitting here in front of me all day has been pretty nerve wracking because I've been dying to open them finally here. So let's get into the unboxing. So this is this big box, Mega Racing. Best parts to get in my opinion. We got this box here as well, another main racing part, parts maybe. And then you have this box, this one's very special. Might show you guys that one in this video, maybe next video we'll see, but that one's very special. We'll see ya. Go ahead and unbox this one. So this guy, as some as some of you can tell, is the strut tower brace, Mega Racing strut tower brace. I also got some braces for the rear. Um, obviously, I'll show you guys that. We'll install those and show you before and after. All that good stuff. This, my friends, is the H brace for the IS. Goes like right in the middle of the chassis. Also, making racing. I'm probably gonna, like, once I get more braces and suspension components, I wanna powder coat them. I don't know if I'll keep them red because, like, the rear end control arms and toe arms and all the suspension parts from Megan Racing are blue and I like to everything to match so for now I'm gonna keep everything the color that it is um, same thing with all the suspension parts keep them all the same color and then once I have everything that I want we'll take everything off and powder coat them all yellow or you know some crazy color some bright color that way you can like like to stand out so now that we have all the parts unboxed i'm gonna go out to the car uh finish jacking it up and then we will get started on install so the last package that I've been dying to open is something I've wanted for a very long time. So I'm about to unbox it. I wasn't gonna wait, but I can't wait. And uh Let's get into it. I mean, I don't even know what to say. I'm so excited. Uh, yeah, let's just do it. I'm scared, guys. I'm scared. You guys ready? Beautiful that is. 
goodness. Holy crap. That is beautiful. No words right now. No words. Came with a fuel rail. Even though I already have one, but who knows? We might run this. Got all the hardware, all the O-rings, fittings. I have to look for a throttle cable. I know Powerhouse Racing makes custom throttle cables. I've heard you can use a Land Cruiser throttle cable. You have to trim it down, but I don't know how to do that. So I just gotta do more research, but she's a beauty. It's the last piece I need, that, or this is the last piece I wanted before I get the car tuned. And it's finally here, right in front of me. There we go, it's perfect. Just look at that. We'll go ahead and take the, the plastic off, but that's beautiful. All right, uh, I'm gonna evaluate the parts I'm gonna install, or what I need to uninstall, and uh, just check it out and see what I'm getting myself into. It's very hard to see under here, but we'll be replacing this guy, this bar right here, and then, can't really see this one because my exhaust, but be replacing this guy, goes to there. And then that third bar goes from this bolt, um, I think back behind the diff, and then up to this bolt. So it'll be nice to get some, get some color under here, get rid of this dirty crap. Pretty good. This one you can barely see, but looks good. This one is supposed to go from that to the back of that one to the back of the other one. Got well, my exhaust in the way, so whatever. We'll try to fit this other brace on and then do the strut tower brace. So I test fitted this guy, it doesn't fix my exhaust as well. So a uh, new stainless steel exhaust is definitely on the list. Mine is pretty much just pieced together, full three inch. And I think if we did a nice stainless steel three inch exhaust, tucked up a little higher um, on the back, it does hit like the lower control arm. You don't, you don't notice it while it's on, while the car's running, but be nice to get that all done and then maybe get like a one of them titanium hks tips muffler tips and have it interchangeable with the the blast pipe but yeah so probably end up doing my exhaust fairly soon stay tuned for that video We'll get that exhaust done, clean it up, and then be able to install braces. Hopefully, I'll have more braces by then. It'll be a good time to install them since I'll be under there anyways. Uh, we'll go ahead and move to this guy, strut tire brace. I'll go ahead and install that. Just uh, three 12 mils, I believe, on both sides. Drop it in, bolt it up.
still plastic on it, you gotta peel it off, but looks pretty damn good. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Unfortunately, it didn't go as, as planned, but when does everything go as planned on the cars? So we'll end up doing, redoing the whole exhaust, getting it tucked up higher so I can fit that. That guy in there, fit that red piece. And then, you know, hopefully I'll have more braces by then. But that's the plan for a future video. Uh, as far as the intake manifold goes, we'll start that probably next video. We'll pull, you know, we'll pull this guy off. We're gonna end up redoing, I'm gonna redo the fuel lines. Obviously I have to make new intercooler piping. It's gonna go into this hole right here. It's a little dark, but into that hole right there. Obviously it's gonna come this way and then down. Um, we'll be making that whole side new. Maybe, might just use that piece right there, that 90. Be redoing that, moving the fuel pressure regulator. I could you run the factory uh, power steering uh, reservoir from the IS, the factory IS power steering reservoir, because mine's back there, but currently it doesn't have any fluid in it, so I haven't been run, running power steering, which sucks. But that should go back to the original spot, and then we got a bunch of other goodies we'll be doing. But stay tuned for the next video. Appreciate you guys watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, guys. Helps me out. Um, I know I've been gone for a while, but I'm getting back into things. Uh, follow me. Follow me on Instagram. I'll leave my Instagram uh, in the description below. Let me know if you guys have any questions or. Let me know what you guys want to see. But that's it. See you guys later. Peace out.